One of my biggest frustrations with spring gardening is my consistent inability to rid my vegetable garden of weeds. For some reason, no matter how hard I try, no matter the technique I use, they always seem to grow back a couple weeks later every year, even though I'm pretty sure I got every last one. Although the chances of me becoming a professional gardener are very low, the story of my failed gardening due to weed regrowth has strong parallels to what can happen to cancer cells in our own bodies. Around 40% of women who undergo breast tumor removals in Canada will leave that surgery with cancer cells remaining in their bodies. This is a concern because these cells can spread throughout the body or regrow into new aggressive tumors. These women will often get called back into surgery to remove the regrowth, disrupting their lives once again and reintroducing fears of cancer they thought were gone. This happens because breast tumors are often not palpable, meaning the surgeons can't feel or see any visual difference in the tissues in front of them. Giving surgeons real-time information about the tissues they're cutting into would give the thousands of women and their families peace of mind and reassurance that the first surgery to remove the cancer would be the last. The Intelligent Knife, also known as the Eye Knife, is a revolutionary mass spectrometry machine that has the ability to give surgeons this kind of real-time information and allow them to detect that fine margin between cancer and healthy tissue. The knife portion of the Eye Knife is a cautery device, as you can see on the left which burns tissue when cutting through it. This creates a smoke that then gets aspirated through the mass spectrometer. From the smoke, the eye knife can create chemical profiles of the tissue that's being burnt. During our research, the tissue that was burnt gets sent to histopathology, from which we can get tissue information that we can use to characterize these chemical profiles as either fat, skin, or cancerous tissue. As we can increase data collection, we can start to create a database of these different chemical profiles. Our research is focused on using this database to create an artificial intelligence supported recognition model that can identify patterns between and within these different chemical profiles. This model can then be used in real time to accurately and consistently identify the smoke being collected by the eye knife. With this model deployed in the operating room, we would be able to notify surgeons when they're cutting through cancer. If they accidentally cut through the tumor, they would get a red alert, as you can see on the bottom. And with that notification, they would be able to go back to that same location and remove more tissue from that margin until that margin is completely clear within the same surgery. With this integrated technology deployed in the operating room, women would be able to have peace of mind in leaving their surgeries knowing that all of the cancerous tissue was removed the first and only time. Thank you.